DNA. By sequencing the virus genome, we can trace its lineages and identify different strains as it mutates. In time, a full understanding of the SARS-CoV-2 genome will help model epidemic growth, and tracking genetic variations will help develop sustainable vaccines. But already our work, and the work of other labs across the country, is making a vital contribution to getting the pandemic under control. For example, by analysing the strains present in local flare-ups, we can help public health authorities select the right control measures. Following a recent outbreak at a Norfolk chicken factory, we identified all cases came from the same strain that had previously only been detected in mainland Europe. That told us that the transmission was confined, rather than being contracted in the local community, meaning that responses should focus on the factory staff. Similarly, we confirmed that cases at Ipswich Hospital were from many different strains, indicating that they had not been transmitted within the hospital. By mapping the prevalence of different strains around the country, we can understand how the virus spreads. At Quadrum, we have identified more than 100 lineages in the population since the first UK cases in March, none of which originated directly from China. This is cutting-edge research in which the UK is leading the world. Here at the Quadrum Institute, we're proud to be part of that work, as our genome detectives help society find a way through, and eventually, out of the COVID-19 pandemic.